Pick is in for the Cowboys at 238 overall here in round seven. It is Matt Farniak, offensive tackle out of Nebraska. All Tom, right, it looks so, like you're going to have to drink again, So right? the rules are, if we don't have them in the database, I do a giant shot. If I did not watch them, I drink. So uh, Matt Farniak out of Nebraska. I watched the other Nebraska lineman. Bottoms up. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, so we, he is in our database, so that's good. I, I mean, um, I, I got I got some background research notes here. Um, yeah, go ahead. He's played right tackle, right guard, and center. I think interior offensive line might be his place. He's six eleven, as you can see, three uh, or six five. Jesus Christ, six five, three hundred eleven, three hundred eleven <laughs> pounds. Decent arm length there. He was a two-time team captain, so I like it from that perspective. That's always a good thing there. Kicked inside this year for Nebraska. You know, the athletic ability is is nothing special by any stretch of the imagination. Decent athletic ability is something I always value here. Let me double check. I'm going to put his, his, his stats into the – ooh, okay. Really good athlete at his size. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm plugging it in, into, the, uh, into the relative athletic score database here. Really good athlete. Yeah. So from that perspective, having not watched him, let's ride. This is a very <laughs> good – if you're taking athletes in round seven, first off, no such thing as a bad seventh-round pick. Back-to-back -back years, I didn't know who they took because, or they didn't study the guy because Ben DiNucci was drafted last year here. Matt Farniak, great athlete at his size. Looking at the numbers that I have here, a Nebraska fan just tweeted me he should have went undrafted, but he's a good athlete, so like, that's hey, fine. Take a chance. Taking a chance on an athlete in round seven, I'm not gonna complain there. Disappointed that Ardarius Washington not the pick. Something's up there, but it's round seven. There is, it is literally not possible to have a bad seventh round pick. Yeah. It's the seventh round. The guy you wanted to sign in free agency. Not losing anything. Not an issue with me here at all. I'm looking at the interior guys I left on the board. Someone's up with David Moore. I don't love the rest of the guys all that much on the interior either. So from that perspective, I'm not going to complain. I've complained plenty about this year's Dallas Cowboys draft class. But going with a high-end athlete in round seven, offensive line, that's not a problem for me, period.